Hi friends, welcome back to Cadable. Today we will do a very simple exercise of uh, making uh, tennis ball in SolidWorks. First of all, we will model it in SolidWorks 2020 and then we will apply some uh, material and color to this ball. And uh, we will do some uh, basic rendering using uh, SolidWorks add-in photo view 360. I hope you will enjoy it and uh, let's start the tutorial. Just go to new and uh, select part and press ok. And now we are in SOLIDWORKS interface. I will change it uh, to plain white and uh, my units are already in MMGS so go to front plane select sketch and uh, first uh, we will sketch a circle and uh, the dimension of the circle is uh, 50 mm so change it to 50 and uh, now I will uh, I'll draw a center line because uh, I need a revolve boss command. Uh, using trim entities, I'll trim the I'll trim this portion of the circle and uh, select OK. Go to features and uh, I'll select uh, revolve boss command. I need a, a solid ball, so select yes and press OK. So uh, tennis ball is created, and now uh, I'll apply. Uh, I'll make a sketch for. Uh, 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 for this command, I need a sweep cut command. So, just go to right plane, select sketch, and uh, select uh, normal to view. And uh, we'll make uh, a center rectangle. And this cent uh, center rectangle will be uh, for construction purpose. And uh, both lines should be equal. And uh, now I'll make a three point arc using this point, this point, and this point. And now I'll make uh, another uh, rectangle, this time corner rectangle. And uh, this line and this line should be equal. And I'll trim this portion of this uh, rectangle. And now I just delete this relation. And uh, let's delete this relation. Still dangling, and uh, now it is uh, uh, it is still under underdefined, but uh, it will work for us. Just uh, go to features, go to uh, uh, curves, select split line, and uh, select this uh, this surface, and select OK. And uh, just go to rebuild, and uh, it is fine. Uh, I need to go to options and uh, go to document properties. I need a better quality uh, image. Just drag it to here and uh, select OK. And now it is uh, uh, it is fine. Uh, it will increase your uh, file size, but uh, uh, the quality of this uh, tennis ball is uh, also uh, also fine. Uh, now I'll go to sweep cut command. I'm in the features tab and uh, go to sweep cut command and uh, just select this uh, uh, this profile. And uh, just select a circular profile. In fact, a circular profile. And I need a 3 mm profile with uh, merged uh, tangent faces. And select OK. So we are done with this uh, tennis ball. And lastly, I'll apply some uh, appearance and uh, colors to this ball. So go to appearance tab and uh, I'll go to fabric and uh, go to carpet and I'll apply I'll apply it uh, here in fact uh, not apply it to body because I don't need it in uh, uh, this uh, sweep cut just go to appearance again and uh, select uh, this appearance and uh, I need to apply only on this face and this face uh, 
and now uh, I need another fabric to uh, which I'll apply on this uh, sweep cut command and now we are done with this uh, appearance just select uh, both uh, both fabrics go to color and uh, I'll apply a color of uh, let's say 221 and this will be 0 and this is fine so uh, also I need uh, plain white color for this uh, cut out and now we are done with this uh, uh, with this uh, appearance and color and uh, lastly i'll render it to uh, photo view 360 go to op uh, options uh, in fact uh, go to add-ins and uh, i'll select uh, photo view 360 and now uh, renders tab uh, is appeared on this uh, timeline and uh, just select perspective and uh, i think uh, i think it is fine And now I'll apply render. It will take some time to render. And uh, so uh, we are done with this uh, uh, tutorial of uh, uh, tennis ball. I hope you like it and uh, if you have any questions regarding this tutorial uh, you can ask in uh, comment section uh, thanks for watching